Hello Gemini, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly tarot reading. For the sign of Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus and it will be from the 28th of December to the 28th of December 2020 to the 3rd of December 2021. <laughs> so I wish you a happy new year. I hope you uh, have a good one. And I'm going to do a bit of a mini reading this week, Gemini, because like so many, it's just been a bit chaotic for me over Christmas and New Year. But I did want to get something out. And obviously, if it's still meant to resonate for you, it still will. It won't resonate with everybody, so just take what resonates with you. So we'll pull three cards. The first card is you, your challenge. Second card is advice from spirit. The third card is the outcome, should you take the advice. And then we clarify the cards and go deeper into the message. And it won't resonate with everybody, so just take what resonates with you. We have the fool in your challenge. Two of swords is advice from spirit. The ace of cups, very beautiful, is your outcome oh my goodness I've got the knight of pentacles here okay Gemini this is so beautiful you know the fool is a card of real optimism I mean you can see all that yellow which is a uh, beautiful warm positive energy uh, it's also an energy of divine energy shining on the fool lighting the path you know there's blind faith with the fool he will take the leap of faith into the unknown into a new beginning even because it feels right because he trusts in the universe that he will be provided for everything that he needs so there's a lovely energy of optimism carrying very little baggage with you ready for a new beginning with the fool but it's in your challenge position so there's a sense you could be holding back from this gemini or there's some kind of reason to hold back It's not, a, it's not a time to take risks as well, I have to say. Um, but it might well be that for whatever reason, something is making you hold back. Consider something clearly. Because I've got this stuck energy in the advice from spirit. So the two of swords is somebody who puts a blindfold over their eyes so they can't see the way forward. And... Sometimes this can be about not wanting to see the truth of the situation or not being clear on how to make a decision or choice. So they feel stuck. Which way do I go? You know, it can sometimes be about making just difficult choices, difficult decisions or overcoming any difficulty that you might be struggling with in your own energy. The message is that the answer is not in your external environment. The answer is in your intuition and how you need to move forward. Um, so the message is to make decisions, choices with this, you trust your intuition to guide you in the right direction. When you don't see with your normal senses, your intuitive sense will guide you in the right direction. Now, there's also a sense here that you don't have full clarity. So there might well be a situation where something isn't completely clear to you and therefore you're just holding back for whatever reason. And it might well be just wait until things become clear. You know, Spirit is saying just wait until things become clear. Um, can some some, sometimes be about weighing things up until things become clear to you in which you in which way you need to go. But again, there's definitely an energy of your instinct is guiding you in a specific direction here. Just wait until you instinctively know how to move forward. Because the fool can be that leap of faith, taking a chance. But it feels in this situation there is an energy here, Gemini, of just being maybe holding back in a situation until something becomes clear, maybe even from within. Because we have the Ace of Cups. So definitely feels in this energy, Gemini, that whatever you might be waiting for or considering, is definitely linked with a powerful new beginning. Again, the fool is, you know, this powerful new beginning waiting to happen. And this is the new beginning that you're being offered. So there's definitely an energy with the Ace of Cups of the Cup of Joy is offered to you here. Um, 
this is something that brings you happiness and joy now in terms if it was for example it, it can be anything it can be a gift it can be a gesture it can be some something that somebody does for you you know um but the ace of cups can be creative opportunities opportunities that will allow you to express yourself fully so very good in terms of money and career the ace of cups is linked with this knight of pentacles so the knight of pentacles is somebody making you an offer an opportunity now this can be in terms of money and career so something that brings you joy that's opening a new door so you might have just been waiting or weighing things up but definitely things are going to become clear the offer is coming your way so in money and career this is great this can also be in terms of love romance something that connects to your heart um so the ace of cups can be an offer in terms of love romance relationships it's a beautiful beautiful energy it's bringing positive change and interestingly enough the knight of pentacles can sometimes represent an offer or an opportunity that's long awaited that has taken time to come but when it arrives it's something solid stable secure it doesn't crumble beneath your feet it is what it is it is the energy of there's no hidden you know agenda or you know anything it is just exactly as it is so it's something that you can trust so either to do with love romance relationships could be to do with your money and career here could be something that you've been waiting for here um, that is very much connected to your heart that's bringing you joy and happiness you know uh, but it feels like somebody is offering you this or doing something for you for this because the knight of pentacles it can be an energy of of, of service to others you know it's, it's a virgo energy so i sometimes see that in these types of readings as maybe somebody's doing something for you as well but i love this energy gemini of if you have been weighing things up or not quite have been reserved in 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 waiting for something to to become clear it feels the offer is going to be becoming clear either in terms of love romance happiness joy coming your way or it can also be to do with money career somebody actually making you an offer now this can be to do with contracts uh, job offers um, incoming client wins um, some money coming your way it feels very beautiful but it's making you happy yeah and it's guided to you by spirit the hand of god the divine who is showing you love you know the ace of cups is spirit showing you love filling your cup with you know spiritual love absolutely beautiful so i'm going to pull a final card final message for gemini i love the energy gemini so we have the polar bear nurture allow any anxieties and worries to be gently released and offered up to be healed it feels that something is about to be released here and greater happiness or the beginnings of of something more uplifting is coming your way so it feels very beautiful gemini i hope you enjoyed the reading if you did please do like share and subscribe i hope it's a wonderful week for you happy new year and i will see you next time thank you